Sal, but anyways, this is Curio, and this is, I guess, figures, action figures, whatever you want to call it. And this is Black He-Man, or Nemesis He-Man, but Anti-Eternia He-Man. Most evil man in the universe. Now, I think this is the good He-Man, actually. This is the real He-Man. But this was actually the second Origins figure I ever got. I was really demoralized. I got this for like 15 bucks, and it was like, you know, the tax or shipping came out to like 16. It was somebody else fulfilled on Amazon. But you can see he's actually kind of cool looking. I was thinking maybe instead of the axes and stuff being black, they could have went with like a red motif. So my first one, I had gotten a Horde Trooper from Amazon. And I mean, it came, the box was like all creased and damaged. I mean, you can see this is pretty decent. The guy had like a piece of paper in the box. You know, like, it was decent. You know, like, you could see that's basically what he did. You know, I had like a piece of box in there. So it was like, you know, like some paper, nothing too crazy. And you can see the back of He-Man includes a comic book. With the power of Hell Skull, which is pretty cool. The fearsome He-Man overthrew Antia Eternia using his unmatched strength. So, I really want Baker, so I was looking up Baker and then this guy I saw. And so, th th this guy that I got from Amazon, I mean, the box was like, I have it, I'll probably show it in another thing, but I don't want to tarnish this. But So, this was pretty cool. I was pretty happy to get this one, you know. And it comes with comic and stuff, but you can see, I mean, the box isn't in the Gem 10 condition, but this is like reasonable. This is what I was kind of expecting the Horde Trooper, which I really wanted. So I've been having a lot of issues, I'm having like muscle and nerve spasms non-stop. So I mean, my experience with the Amazon was so bad, that I was like never going to buy a toy again, but I already had this one ordered. So I'm glad this came in decent condition. Uh, Faker is my favorite one, growing up was my favorite. So I, I would like to get Faker Origins, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get it. They wanted like 26 for it. So I got this one, it was like 15, and then they had wanted like the Ford one was like 17 or 18, but... I actually ended up getting a refund on that. Amazon hung up on me like three times. They violated the American Disabilities Act because they wouldn't let you take care of your account unless you had to do like the email verification thing. And then when I had the guy on the phone that did it without it, he hung up like right when he was about to do everything. So whatever. But yeah, this one I think was supposedly invented by Scott, the toy guru Nightlick or whatever, Spectre Creative. I think this was like the thing that he pushed for, but not in Origins, and like another one. But like I said, this is pretty cool. This isn't for kids. This is nostalgia. or It's sealed in a box. Kids play with toys. I'm not opening this toy. If you're one of the people that play with your toys, maybe it's for kids. But this isn't for kids. This is for the adult collector, people in their 40s and 50s that don't have much going for them in life, like me. But anyways, the anti attorney He-Man I think is really cool. It makes me think like Dragon Ball Z, Goku Black, and stuff like that. Like I said, Faker is my favorite one growing up, so hopefully I can get Faker. I still have my original Faker somewhere. So this is kind of like the Black Faker. I guess that's one way to look at it. But he's not a robot. He's more like the He-Man. Faker is kind of cool because he's got like the blue He-Man, but he's got the Skeletor outfits. But anyways, this is uh, my favorite Origins figure because it's actually in decent condition. I'm glad that the other seller on Amazon, sent it in decent condition, where, you know, it's reasonable condition, that's what I was expecting, I was expecting Gem 10 Mint, super collective, but at least do some packing material, Amazon's got billions of dollars, they went through three cents in packing material, but I don't want to talk too much about that one, or maybe I'll do that again, but anyways, thanks, and take care.